Hi, this is Gilles, and this is a quick review of the Fnirzi. I say Fnirzi, I have no idea how to pronounce it, <laughs> but Fnirzi will do for now. It's a, a radiation detector, and this is a fake, a clone that I got on AliExpress. This one was half the price of the real one that I bought on the uh, Fnirzi website. So I'll turn them on. see here and no buzzer on this one no brand name uh, welcome screen otherwise they look very similar the fonts are not exactly the same the Fnirzi has a little bit of a thicker font other than that the cases look practically identical but there are some small differences the holes here next to the uh, uh, USB-C ports are well-defined here. And on the fake, it's a little less so, a little less precise. Other than that, uh, you really would be hard-pressed to tell the difference. The plastic doesn't feel exactly the same. It's just small differences. Uh, you can tell that probably they don't come from the same factory or maybe a different lot or something like that. Now this one, the real one, doesn't have the same tube that's in this one. Other than that, uh, the measurements seem to be just about the same, but of course that doesn't mean much. Unfortunately, I don't have any uh, sample to, to use to, to test those detectors with. The menus are the same, there are no differences. So it's really hard to tell them apart. Of course, the fake one doesn't have the uh, Fnirzi brand here. So is it worth it to, to buy the real one? I think so, because uh, let's have a look inside. So this is the Fnirzi. It has a bigger tube, actually, uh, than the copy. And this one is very different. Uh, you can see the battery is not the same. The circuit is not the same. It's, it's a very different device. The Fnirzi has a battery. And uh, it has a, uh, a buzzer here. It's just very different, although the cases are almost identical, but not quite. You'll also notice that the, uh, the Fnirzi has a red LED that uh, turns on when there is a, a collision. But the fake one doesn't. So the real one has an M4011 tube, and that's the equivalent of the uh, J321. That's what it should have against the fake that has a, uh, a smaller tube of a lesser quality. So I definitely wouldn't recommend getting the fake one. That's why it's worth paying, you know, twice the price, about $50 for the real deal. This is about four and a half hours later. The uh, cumulative count here for the uh, Fnirzi is at 0 0.42, that's in uh, microsieverts. The, uh, the fake one is at 0 0.17, and that's less than half, so definitely a better choice and a better tube.